Arnold explained that turtles are necessary to the health of the ecosystem. Turtles are really a neat part of the ecosystem. A lot of people think, oh, it's just a turtle. What does it really do? You know, turtles, in large part, they consume a lot of uh, dead or decaying materials, and as well as aquatic plants and things like that. So where are you likely to find a turtle crossing the road around town? Typically, I, I tend to see them more it, on venues that would pass between water bodies, whether that's a, a drainage, and if we look behind us, you can see there's a lot of trees. This goes down to a drainage, um, areas between ponds and things like that. So there's a few things to do in case you come across the ancient reptile while in your car or even in your own backyard. Agent Arnold stressed that they highly discourage pulling off the side of the highway or busy roads to save the turtle for your own safety. But if you are on a rural road or can safely park on the shoulder, then... We want to be very careful with ever trying to touch or pick up, especially those larger snapping turtles. Um, if you don't touch the turtle, the turtle probably won't bite you or try to bite you. And, and the good thing is if you give them time, they're usually going to move on to the habitat they want. Some experts even suggest getting the turtle to bite onto a stick or piece of cloth while you coax it to safety. But if that's not possible, remember. If you can slow down and try to avoid hitting that's great, but I would never encourage somebody to swerve their vehicle because if you try to swerve to miss a deer, a uh, turkey, whatever it is, a turtle that's in the road, uh, you take that risk of losing control of your vehicle and causing a wreck. If you have questions about turtle nesting or habitat, you can visit the website you see on your screen. Angie Lastman, Fox 26, KNPN.